Yeah, Felix, we're looking ahead to next season with this team. There are a ton of questions still to be answered, right? We know the Dejan Vasiljevic piece, right? He signed that three-year extension to remain there. So then all eyes turned to that head coaching vacancy, and I thought it was interesting last night. Dejan Vasiljevic sat in front of reporters after their loss to the Brisbane Bullets, and he gave a very emphatic endorsement for Scott Ninnis. Take a look. Uh, I want to keep harping on it. Scott deserves it. Um, you watch where we were at the FIBA break when CJ was fired. He took over. I think we had three days or two days to prepare for Cairns. We gave up 116, 117 points. Then we went to United, competed well against them, uh, beat Brisbane. Um, then, lo then lost two games and the new year rolled over and you beat United, you beat Sydney, you have a close one against Cairns and each week we got better and better and better and we were starting to get respected. It wasn't being last, it was like, oh, Adelaide might make the six. So for sure, Scotty does deserve it and I would be pissed if he's not the coach for two years and onwards. Mm, telling comments indeed. So it appears the players want Ninnis, the fans want Ninnis. There's a couple of other people I know that wants Ninnis. Some interesting comments made by Gorgian with Daniel Harper this week on radio. And just before I let you go, Brian, uh, do you like Adelaide? <laughs> I, I think it's a great program. <laughs> I really do. I, I think it's uh, a great program and, and uh, it has unbelievable potential. When I came over here, uh, that, that was, it was Melbourne and South Australia. And I know they got great ownership. And uh, again, my, my situation on, on co again, I don't want to take anybody's job or I've just let everybody know whether it's here or there, I'm available. And if there's um, a team here that, that needs my services or I can be a, of, of help, I'm in. If, if, if they need something and uh, there's something available there, there would definitely be an interest. Now, Felix, fellas, I'm told that earlier this week, Brian Gorgian met with Grant Kelly, the owner of the Adelaide 36ers. Now, they discussed the potential of Gorgian filling that eventual head coach vacancy in Adelaide. Now, this is the first correspondence that the 36ers and Gorgian have had in this process, and it gives us an idea in the interest that Adelaide has in Gorgian and the fact that there is a, a mutual part of that too. And so, Brian Gorgian has done this before in Illawarra. He came into that franchise and he helped uh, lift them from the scrap heap. And, and this is something that it seems like he may want to do in Adelaide. And as much as Scott Ninnis has a ton of goodwill in that team, it's a very hard thing to turn down Brian Gorgian if there's mutual interest there. Well, one of my favourite sayings in sport is when there's smoke, there's fire. And when the goat comes a-knocking, it is my personal opinion that you open that door.